talk about Jimmy Garoppolo's magic number. So Debo Samuel's magic number is three. Jimmy Garoppolo's magic number is 30 in the sense that in his career with the 49ers, including playoffs, when he throws fewer than 30 passes in a game, he's 18 and four. When he throws 30 or more, seven and nine. So I'll repeat that. Someone pointed this out on the cone phone this weekend. 29 or fewer, 18 and four. 30 or more passes in a game, seven and nine. How many passes did he have against the Seattle? 30. How many passes did he have in the Super Bowl? 31. Why is this a thing with Jimmy Garoppolo? Well, Jimmy Garoppolo is turnover prone. In 10 and a half games this year, he has 11 turnovers, 12 if you count the safety. That's okay if you have big plays, you make big plays and throw a lot of touchdown passes. He doesn't do that. Brady has 10 turnovers and 34 touchdown passes. Jimmy has 11 turnovers and 15 touchdown passes. The turnovers are come at a high rate. The big plays do not. So the more snaps he has, the more pass attempts he gets, the more likely he is to turn the ball over and lose the game for you. So the whole game is taking the ball out of Jimmy's hands. Let's see how few amount of times we can have him pass. If you have a great running game and you ask him to throw you know, tw- less than 30 times, he's a decent quarterback. He's pretty good because he's actually good on third down in the sense that if it's third and 11, he'll throw 12 yards. If it's third and 11, 12, he'll throw 13 yards. He wants to throw past the mark. He wants to pick up the first down. He has the right mentality. He's aggressive. He has the quick release. And he will move the chains, allow the Niners to keep running the ball. Um, That's what he does well. The problem is those aren't really big plays. And they come at a price. If you're the kind of quarterback who has the mentality, I'm going to pick up all these third downs. I'm going to be aggressive throwing the ball over the middle. Well, it's going to come with picks too. And he has just, I think he has five touchdowns and four interceptions on third down this year. Comes at a price. Turnovers. So you get some third down conversions, but you're not getting big plays. That You don't get big plays from Jimmy's legs, not from his arm, and you get a lot of turnovers. So there's no there's no reason to want him to throw a lot. <laughs> the big plays come when he's hands off. And that's why you can't pay this guy $27 million. It's fine to have a quarterback who is a good complement to a running game. But that's just, you pay that, you pay nothing for that. That's cheap. If you're paying a guy $27 million a year, he has a franchise quarterback is someone who isn't dependent on his team running for 150 yards, his team limiting his attempts to 27 or fewer. That's not a franchise quarterback. I mean, I don't have to explain that every every week, but it's interesting to like put it in perspective when people say, oh, he's a winner, he's a winner, he's a winner. Yeah, if his running game's going, if he doesn't have to throw 30 times, as soon as the game is put on his shoulders, he's a losing quarterback. And that's what Pete Carroll exposes every time they play. He shuts down the run game. He puts the game on Jimmy's shoulders. And Jimmy loses more than he wins in those situations. That's what happens. Magic number is 30.